Hi guys, this is Matt again. I'm just trying to figure out what can open a beer bottle or whatever drink that has a cap. That is the question. So, oh, I gotta see my face. Let's try on my desk. Only using items on my desk here. Uh, this is more, uh, most likely going to be items you guys have at home. So, let's go with... Uh, Let's go with a Q-tip. Who doesn't have a Q-tip in a house or party or, I don't know, in a car-ish? So what I'm going to do right now, I've never tried this before, but what I will do with a Q-tip, I will bend it in half to break it. I was hoping for a better break than that, but... Alright, so we got two tiny ends. We got the really sharp, that's what I'm looking for, the sharp end here. So let's try this right now. Uh, we're gonna hold. We're gonna go over the same stance as we usually do, uh, and go right underneath here. Let's see if Q-tips can open a beer. Let's see. It's not looking good. It just it just breaks the Q-tip. It's just breaking the Q-tip. See if I can change that angle right here. Yeah, it just keeps on breaking the Q-tip. Alright. And we don't get any sound. That's not good. So Q-tip does not work. Let's try something else, shall we? We do have... We, have, we do have oatmeal. Let's try to open it with oatmeal, alright? It's a twist off, but I mean... This is an unopened bag of oatmeal. Let's use a corner, actually. We'll let's pull it this way. Just try to do as many layers as we can in a single corner. There you go. So I'm not going to be twisting the cap off, because that'd be cheating. But I will just be bending in the corner of the oatmeal package. Let's try that. Oh. I'll try bending it more. Will it open a beer? That is the question. Still oatmeal. If you guys can hear that, that's actually oatmeal bag uh, ripping. Let's try it this way. Alright, well, I'll try it a bit more. Two more tries, maybe. The other side. Alright, as much as I have, uh, I have to call this thing, it does not work with a bag of oatmeal. Do not try that. Alright, let's actually try something. 